Hi right, y'all, I gotta bring y'all the great news for the YouTube channel. First thing first, I wanna thank God for this opportunity and for showing me something that's totally different. Now, today is my first day of the USPS orientation. And there's a lot of valuable information that they gave to us today. I am ecstatic, to say the least, to be able to experience this. You know what I'm saying? Um, I do have to say that these are just my personal opinions, you know, about, you know, this job. And word, I have to say that before I even continue with this video. Now, like I said, I am ecstatic for this opportunity. Um, for those that are new, right? Because I'm new. But for those that are just now like applying or they've been waiting some time to get their orientation date, you know, you probably done your fingerprints, things like that. I do want to tell you this. Be patient. Because this process alone took me a whole entire month just to start the orientation day. I applied back in September and then I was able to do my fingerprints. And then after that, that took another two weeks. And now today is the first day of orientation. There will be a lot that you learn throughout the orientation. We're not even done yet. They gave us like a 30 minute lunch break, but I already ate earlier. So I'm not even gonna purchase any food. Um, you will have a instructor, you know, that's going to show you videos. Hopefully on your first day, you're able to take your ID picture, which you guys will see right here. You know what I'm saying? Y'all look at that. <laughs> that's about to be the thumbnail. You feel me? And they do tell you, um... The next day you have like a driving instructed class. It's not the test, it's not the course. They call it a test, of course, you know, same thing. But it's not that, it's the class. So I won't be able to tell y'all what the driving instructed class consists of until I take the class. Um, another thing is do not come late. They take the time very, very serious because they're paying you for this. You know what I'm saying? You're getting paid for the orientation. You're getting paid for the driving instructor class. And then they also give you your shadow day. Now, like I said, me personally, I am very, very thankful for this opportunity, especially coming from doing food delivery. This is like a breath of fresh air because this is a federal government job. You know what I'm saying? And like I said, like I thank God for this opportunity because this is a opportunity that you should be willing to take. You know? And I get it, bro. Like when they say, oh, at a job, you're nothing but a number. I, I, I get that. I learned to understand that, bro. But I also learned to understand that I'm still a human at the end of the day and when the universe rewards you with opportunities you have to be grateful you know um so i am starting out as a cca which is a city carrier assistant and then of course like they make you wait you gotta wait at least like two years to become they call it a regular but you can potentially be a regular before then it just depends on your work ethic your attendance you know um things like that whatever state whatever uh, area they have you stationed in you know things like that but like i said today is the first day it does consist of a lot of videos i have been taking a lot of notes but i did leave the notes upstairs um i just wanted to make a quick video for those that's that's new to this experience because people want to know like what is it like um, you will be watching videos about the USPS. They will show you videos on how the mail is, like how people get their mail. You know, it goes through a whole entire process, um, which is very, very cool. And uh, 
you have to pay attention to the videos, you know? If I were you, I would take notes. I know some people don't like to take notes. They think that they're, like, some of us think, like, our mind could just take in everything and we won't forget nothing. But me, I already know, bro. Like, your mind can only take in but so much information. I understand we're limitless human beings, right? Spiritual beings having this human experience. But you should take notes because you're able to study it. You're able to look it over. Um, they're also going to give you a big booklet, right? The booklet consists of the the um, information that, that you will need. That's I'm going to just say that, right? It's information that you will need. Um, and then uh, you will meet the supervisors, one of the supervisors. They will talk to you. The supervisor that we were able to meet today, she spoke to us. She was very, very, like, kind, you know? Um, I asked questions. I definitely asked her, like, what is one piece of advice you would give to all of us because there's a class of like 16 of us and what is one piece of advice you would give to us pertaining this job because I know that we are in for a lot you know and she kept it real bro she said like the number one thing I can tell y'all is to not give up on yourself like whenever we start something new right we tend to like try to be perfect and pretend we're not gonna make no mistakes but she she definitely let us know like don't give up on yourself and give yourself some grace because you are starting something that's totally new You know Like being a USPS worker Is not just oh you see them driving a truck And you see them delivering mail No bro it's a lot to this job And that's why they put you through training That's why they put you through an academy And in order for you to even Get to the CCA academy You have to pass the driving course Now like I said Tomorrow No no it's a, it's a USPS worker right there You see it but tomorrow, we, like I said, we have the driver's class. And they're going to teach us a lot. They're going to teach us about the trucks. I think we have to take uh, uh, the course in a two-ton truck. I thought it was the LLV. But it's a two-ton truck out here in New York. And the good thing is that it's no right-side driving. It's just left-side, which is like how a regular car is, which is good. Um, she also tells you, like, you're going to... Basically, it's cones. So they treat the cones as pedestrians. So that's why they tell you don't hit nothing. You know? Um, pay attention to your mirrors. That's one thing that they definitely tell you. Pay attention to your mirrors and listen to the instructor. You know what I'm saying? Um, they also tell you too, your your shoes. You have to wear leather shoes that have grip on the bottom. For anybody that is new, if you're starting out, do not come to this job. Especially on the second day and on your shadow day. Do not wear no type of shoes like instance I have on these pumas but this is just because this is this is business casual don't come in with sneakers with open toe shoes like none of that wear leather shoes that that has grip all right um they also tell you to wear like a blue shirt a button-down shirt and like pants like blue pants to match your uniform because you do not get no uniform allowance until your 90 to 120 day probation is up but besides that, bro, it just has been a great orientation so far. Um, just be grateful for the opportunity. That's all I can say, bro. Be grateful for the opportunity. Don't be nervous, you know. Don't be afraid to ask questions because that's what they're there for. They're there for you to ask questions, answer your questions, and just embrace the, you know, embrace the journey, embrace the opportunity. Um, like I said, this is my first day besides me doing my fingerprints. And we got like four more hours of the orientation. And then tomorrow, we got to be right back here at 7 a.m. You know? And then that's another eight-hour day. So, and then like I said, I have the shadow day at my actual location. So, once I, you know, learn more about the driving aspect and like the driver's class and stuff, I'll be able to give off more information for those that's new. But um, besides that, this is just my personal like experience. I'm not speaking for the USPS, no none of that, bro. This is just my personal experience and just letting y'all know like how day one is. And yeah, man, like hopefully y'all that's new and that's on the waiting list, just be patient. You know, be patient. Um, don't be so eager to just be like, oh, they're not gonna call me or they're not gonna email me. Yes, they will. You just have to you gotta wait because there's so many people that apply to these jobs. You know, and you have to constantly check your email and you have to respond fast. You have to respond fast. You have to re respond fast. They give you like a three day window. So, look at the USPS truck, bro. I swear, bro. The alignment is real, y'all. 
the alignment is real chat yes sir yeah but like i said man y'all see the, the id picture um shout out to everybody that's been rocking out with me on the youtube platform give the video a thumbs up so that more people could reach this video leave your comments below and um i'll let y'all know how tomorrow goes after i'm finished with the driving class tomorrow appreciate y'all i love y'all and thank y'all for helping me get the six thousand supporters too thank y'all y'all some real ones shout out to the sr community no fat community thank you god for this opportunity once again i have to show my gratitude bro because this is like, like let's go like, let's go that's the only way i can put it for me appreciate y'all for rocking on me it's your boy thomas carter tc toast tc fitness